All right, I know it's inside here. Let me open up and come on. It's a little heavy. Okay. Okay, first love, not this one, not you. Oh, can we watch this one? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No? Okay. No, it's not here. Let's see. Come on. Oh, oh, oh. yeah, yeah. N no. First love, okay, yeah, yeah. Oh, wait, 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 I think I saw it here. Ah, uh, all right. Here we are. Oh, wait. And we're going to talk about this. Here we go. All right, first love. Now, this is a 2019 film. I saw the trailer on Marathon Samurai. It really caught my attention and I bought it and it was great. I really, really loved this film. Um, I bought it a year ago and yeah, anyway. So what is it about? This boxer has found out that he has a brain tumor and he doesn't have a lot of time to live. Under this horrible news and this depression, he meets this girl who is a drug addict and she has to prostitute herself to pay a loan that her father had with the Yakuza. He now is going to help her out to, I guess, get away of all the trouble that she is, she is in. Now the big problem is that this police officer and this Yakuza are trying to set up an internal war, not an internal war, but well, basically they want the, the Yakuza and the Chinese Mafia to be at war while they trick this young girl that is also selling drugs. I mean, she's not selling drugs, she's actually delivering, uh, again, because of the payment that the loan that her father had. So they're using her, her as a mule. Now, uh, um, they're tr the police officer and the Yakuza, they're trying to make everybody believe like all oh, the Chinese are involved in this um, situation and then the Yakuza, they're going to believe it. And it's going to be like a, this big mafia war where the boxer and the girl are caught in the middle of it. Great action, good things going on here in this film, especially the ending. I really had a great time watching this film and in fact one of the things that I really like is that the title First Love was basically um, how the boxer and the girl they unite themselves and they try to achieve the best of them to to not work things out but to get away from the whole war that is between them and everything happens I believe in just one night and full of excitement and even funny things going to happen. Not everything goes the way you planned, you know? Now, I will say that this film is basically like uh, being at the wrong place or at, at the wrong time. Or is that the right? No, it's, yeah, it's the wrong because, oh boy. Anyway, another thing that I really enjoy is that the girl actually has... Uh, well, I didn't enjoy it, that she has hallucinations because of the drug, but it's one of the most either scary or comical things about the film that make this kind of entertaining. Every character is is quite unique. Also, at the end, they have this um, this scene that I can only think of it like they run out of money and they decided to make this last uh, climatic scene the way they did. Uh, it was okay, it worked for me, and of course the ending will, the guy will get money to have this brain surgery, or the girl will continue on her addiction, or she, will she be able to break free, there is only one way to find out, right, we'll have to see the film, give it a try, watch it, I am sure you're going to enjoy it, and yeah, that's it. Thank you for listening. Did I miss anything else? No. Okay. I'll see you next time. Bye.